while the uh, glue is drying on the application of basing texture material for the latest instalment of my bolt action British para artillery-esque entries for the um, Wargamers Anonymous challenge. I shall do another section of this vid or another vid to show it when it's done, when all the basing's done, but yeah, so far so good. So now I'm gonna move on to that French Napoleonic artillery piece that I mentioned in my video a couple of well, a couple of videos ago. I um, always used to love connoisseur miniatures, very similar to the elite miniatures I, a lot of my friends are based on. And I found this lot, cheap as chips on eBay. Um, painting, well, the detail work on the uniform is so-so. It's nothing, I was thinking of stripping and repainting, but it's nothing that, uh, you know, a bit of shading and some neatening up around the edges, particularly where flesh meets hat there. But other than that, it's just a bit of a neatening of edges and some washes and shading, really. So try and make them look a little bit more presentable. That's next on the agenda. And then after that, to go with uh, these fellas and that machine gun I did, there'll be some British Airborne artillery. Right, carrying on with the update. Um, my rescue paint job on the uh, cheaply purchased horse guard artillery um, from eBay has come along okay. Let's have a little close up of the models themselves. It's not the greatest paint job, but uh, I think it's been done all right, actually. Let's have a look at the gun. Not too shabby. Better than it was, anyway. Um, and on the next video, I'll uh, show the rebasing of it all. And on the subject of rebasing, here's the mortar I showed you earlier, but with the basing finished to go alongside the uh, machine gun that I did for my British Paris. So this is progress so far. These two done. These guys painted or touched up I should say. God that sounds wrong. Um, along with their cannon. Next video will be rebasing these guys and their cannon and I've got one more artillery piece, a howitzer, to go with these guys and that will be my multiple entries for the uh, artillery themed Wargamers Anonymous monthly challenge.